what is in it for the banks to give us credit cards? Uh, money, lots and lots of money. Let's talk about fractional reserve banking because that's actually a good question. And a lot of people don't know this. A lot of business owners don't know about fractional reserve banking. So fractional reserve banking is the law that allows or the process that allows the Federal Reserve to loan money or give money to a bank. And then that bank then loans it out to people. See, banks want to give money to everybody. They do. Banks want to give money to everyone. But they need to make money back. And so they don't give it to people they don't think will pay them. I don't like what I started with. Would you rather loan to the guy who didn't pay a $35 collection or $35 million bankruptcy? 35 guy, 35 million paid his bills and provided lots of jobs and was doing stuff. Yes, things went sideways versus the $35 non-irresponsible person just doesn't want to pay the cell phone bill now. So here's how it works. If I take this $50 bill into the bank and I deposit this $50 bill in the bank, the bank can then loan this out to 10 people. So look, we got more than out on this call tonight. I take this into Wells Fargo. I put it in my bank account. Wells Fargo can loan each and every one of you $50 based on my $50 bill. Banks don't have to use their own money when they loan out. They have to have their own money to start the bank for operating expenses, for insurance, for the building, for employees, for marketing. But they don't spend their money when it comes to loaning it to you. They take my $50, they loan it to 10 other people at 30% interest on a credit card. So the bank pays me 0.01%. So I will make in one year, five cents on this $50, one nickel. The bank will take it and loan it to 10 people at 30% interest via credit card. Now, 30% interest is $15 per card times 10 people. The bank's now making $150 a year in interest off my $50 deposit and paying me a nickel for it. Now, let's make it $1,000. You take $1,000, you put it in your savings account, they loan that out, now it's $100,000 at 30% interest. Now they're making $30,000 in interest from your $1,000 deposit. In exchange, they pay you $10 in interest. They pay you $10. They make $30,000 off of your one-time deposit. Now, here's where it gets really crazy. If they loan it to a woman-owned business or a minority-owned business, they get 60 times. So you take that $1,000, they now get to loan it 60 times. Is that insane or what? They can now loan it out 60 times at 30% interest. I think I screwed up earlier. I said $1,000 would be 100. It would not be 100. It'd be $1,000 would turn into $10,000 for most banks. $60,000 if it's a woman-owned business or a minority-owned business. So on that $10,000, they would make $3,000 in interest. So that's called fractional reserve banking. So the reason that they want to give out credit cards to business owners is because they get a bigger multiplier than just the 10 times. They can go all the way up to 60 times.